You're late. And you're beautiful. See? This is going better than either of us expected. And I'm done. Oh, come on. Don't leave. Not when you've got the premier magician at your fingertips. What makes you think that? Your voice on the phone. Very revealing. All right. Well, let's start with why you're late. I don't care if you think I broke the contract. I saw a better opportunity and I took it. You're the one who bought the stupid theater. Don't try and blame this all on me. You did break the with what proof? That I'm a better businessman? You lost this one, Frank. Get over it. And don't spend all your food stamps in one place. I'll go fuck yourself, you <laughs> Traffic problems. Hmm. I see. Well, I'd like to start off by thanking you for meeting me here. Of course. This is my favorite place. I wonder if Johnny's working today. So, why don't we have a proper introduction? My name is Timothy Andrews, but if you're feeling naughty, you can call me by my stage name. Tim the Terrifying, Master of Magic. <laughs> <laughs> Rolls off the tongue. <laughs> and I'm Phyllis Mullen, uh, staff writer for Stage Monthly magazine. Stage Monthly? Haven't heard of it. It's new. We just started a couple months ago. Actually, you're our biggest profile to date. Now that all the pleasantries are out of the way, do you mind if we get started? Of course. So this guy says to me, Sir, you need to put some clothes on. And I look back and I'm like, Officer, I don't even know whose backyard this is. And so he starts to cuff me, but I run, I leap over the fence and I escape. <laughs> <laughs> That's very funny. <laughs> Oh, uh, so you haven't said a word about yourself. What's your story? Oh, you wouldn't want to hear a boring story like mine. Pfft, nonsense. A beautiful girl like yourself. I'm sure you had a wonderful upbringing. <laughs> yep. yep, that's about it. Boring, yet wonderful. Oh, come on, don't be so shy. I'm all ears. Don't you ever hang up with me again, you Shit. filthy bastard. Without me, you'd be nothing. Hey, Come you broke the you. contract, you son of a bitch. You're dead. Enough, enough, enough. You both need to get the hell out of here or I'm calling the cops. Out. Get out. This is my old business partner. He wanted to cut on my success. Obviously, I said no. I'm sure it'll be okay. Everything will work out. Want to see a magic trick? I've been waiting for that all night. Tim, I honestly think this is the beginning of evening. 